Hello, my name is Manfred and welcome to my kitchen. Today we're going to make a very, very flavorful dip called the curry dip because it's got the curry in it. So let's take the look. It's got the mayonnaise, sour cream, lemon juice of the curry powder, and this is very exciting. So the first thing we got to do is wash our hands. Every time you come uh, in the kitchen, you come back from being outside, it's even a good idea. You'll be touching things uh, all over the place. You don't know who done uh, what with their hands prior to that, if you know what I mean. Use the imagination on that one, you know what I mean? Uh-huh. Okay, we got the hands clean. We got them dry. You always want the dry hands around the kitchen so nothing slips. Let's get started. Okay, the first thing we're going to do, maybe we better do the, uh, the uh, finish the lemon here. We need two Oh, we need the half cup of the lemon juice. Now, so Manfred have got some here. Can you see that in there, uh, tech guy? That's good. This is called the juicer that is not electric. This is the hand juicer. You put it there. Oh, let's rinse this off. Always, you know, they put the stuff on these things, huh? In the, uh, in the, the before they ship them. So let's wipe this off very quickly. Very good. Set that back. Oh, now I got to get the knife. You know, you got to be active in the kitchen. People who say the kitchen is not active, uh, it's very active. Let's take the lemon. Keep the fingers back. Cut through it just like that. We'll set that there. When you use one of these, you take this, just put it on the top and twist. It catches all the little pips. It catches all the... Uh, um, the pulp in that and just leaves the juice. Now, oh, look, that is finished. We get the recycle, which is also called the compost, in there. The compost goes on the garden outside because uh, the garden is easy to keep. Okay, we got the second one. Oh, we're almost finished. You see how fast that is? This, uh, to make the, the uh, half cup of the lemon juice, this one can go in the sink, two points. Uh, how many lemon did we use? Uh, we used three lemons. The camera girl tell me that because she gave me the hand. Okay, let's get started with this. We're going to set that right there. Okay, the first thing, the bowl. You got to have the bowl to put things in. Now I got to get the spatula. Oh, today we're using the blue spatula to match the set. It looks pretty nice. Put the mayonnaise. Uh, this is the mayonnaise right here. Scoop the mayonnaise out. This is a quick dip. You got the friends coming over. You got their relatives. You got them coming to watch the game or maybe to have a little party tonight. This is very quick. There's the mayonnaise. There's the sour cream. Oh, that's real easy. Just like that. Can you see how that comes out? That's excellent. That's two of them done. That's how easy that is. Now the lemon juice we're going to add here. You just pour that in like that. I'm going to set this down. Uh, oh, we don't need the knife uh, right now, so we're going to set the knife right there. Let's get the spoon and uh, stir this up. Well, no, let's use the fork. We got the fork. Oh, can you see that? This is going to be the good dip. Oh, yeah. There it is. Now, while we're stirring this, just put the curry powder in. Now, notice the color. The curry powder that we have is, uh, we'll put these two in the sink also. The curry powder was one tablespoon that we had measured out. You can measure it uh, yourself. Oh yeah, now you want more flavor in it, you can add more curry powder. Can you see the color there? That is beautiful. Oh yeah. Okay. That's all there is to making that. It's simple. It's delicious. You can smell the curry. Can you see that uh, the, there? Uh, that is the perfect curry dip, right there. I am no chef, but I can cook. Now, what are we going to do with this? We're going to make the, uh, the, the, the fruit on the stick, it's called. This is what you're going to dip in here, so we're going to add this on. You can see what's on here. Take a look at this over here. The first thing we got to do it's got carrot with it, so we're going to scrape the carrot off. I don't have this written on the board. Manfred did not put it on the board. Well, you can get it on the web page at Manfred... It, 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 these things. Manfredinthekitchen.com 
You do the scrape, take all the uh, uh, skin off that, like, oh yeah. Can you see how quick and easy that is? Okay, set that down, scrape this all off, in the bucket, you can hear it, that's good. There it goes, more of it, okay. We give the quick, quick, the quick, whoa, Manfred have the problem be, uh, sometime, we get the quick rinse off. Always use the one not for the hands, but the one for the vegetable. Now, this is the trick. We want, can you see that? Can you see how those are twirled on there? These make them very beautiful. So this is what you have to do. Put that down with the peeler, which we just peeled the carrot with. You push the peeler down real hard and make it really long. Just like that. Can you see that? We're, oh, we're just going to make three of them for now. You see? Can you see how that is a strip like that? That's perfect, okay? You take and you just fold it over like that. Can you see that up there? Is that cool? Put the skewer, the skewer, the skewer. This is the stick. This is the stick with the pointy end you get at the grocery store. Uh, maybe at the dollar store, you know, the cheap stores, it's not expensive. Okay, you, there's one. We put that on. Now we're going to take the pineapple. You can buy the pineapple with the chunks or you can go to Manfred in the kitchen. How to clean the pineapple and how to cut the pineapple. We got everything with the Manfred for you for the kitchen. Okay, the cheese. This is an older cheddar cheese. It may split a bit, so we're going to try twist notice what Manfred does just twist it back and forth like that is that perfect it didn't split at all hey how's that that's good huh that's good we're doing okay yeah good next we got uh, what we're gonna do we're gonna put the cherry tomato these are the small small tomato like that press that on oh we take another one of the uh, the uh, carrot, push that on, another one of the pineapple, and push that on, and then we put the olive on the top. Oh, I, I got room left, maybe I just moved them all up like that so it looked nice. There it is. Very nice, you put it on the plate, like this to serve and when the people come to visit your friends your relatives they can dip in into the curry sauce and eat it so there you have it this is the perfect curry dip and the perfect fruit and cheese pineapple carrot and the olive on the stick you can make this fast just like this video and have the friends real happy this is healthy it's homemade it's fresh, it's nutritious, it's delicious, it's simple, it's easy. I am no chef, but I can cook.